Jen BJ here with the Chief Peak, and today we're going to be doing a full body volume training workout. For this workout, we're going to go through 18 exercises for just one set each. Our working time is 60 seconds, our break time is 20 seconds. Every three exercises, we'll then take a 30 second extended break. If you like this workout, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and let's get to work. We have about 20 seconds until we get started with our warm up. If you have a fitness tracking watch, be sure to start your workout. Now, our first exercise we're going to do is chest opener. So we have a slight bend in the elbows, pulling the arms back, feeling the chest stretch out. And as we come across, feeling the back stretch out. A couple seconds till we get started. Here we go. Don't forget to breathe. You kind of move your hands up and down, see where you feel it a little more. I got RDLs next, slight bend in the knees here. Pinching at the hips, feel it stretch out, and coming up. Arm swings after this. We'll go for one more here. Forwards and backwards on these. Go. Don't forget to breathe. Nice smooth movements here. We got good mornings next. So similar setup as to RDLs, except as we come down, we are gonna bend at that lower back. There we go. Nice stiff back this morning. Body of the squats. There we go. So feet shoulder width apart, drop it down, coming up. Go at your own pace during these. Arm circles, hands out. Oops. Nice small circles <laughs> moving into larger circles. You can reverse it if you want. <laughs> Alternating toe touch kicks. Keeping that back straight, feeling it in the hamstrings. Do you feel the hamstrings or is it just me? No, I feel it a little bit. <laughs> Fin over rotations. <laughs> Here, and up. After this 20 second break, I'm getting started with the workout. Let's get one more here. 40 second break. We're going in to alternating high rows first. So lighter weight here than you would do for normal rows. <clears throat> We're gonna hinge at the hips and then just go left, right, left, right on these. We're keeping our elbows in line with the shoulders on these. And here, so as we come up, we're here, not here. Did you do double? Yes, I did. Yeah, you can start off with doubles. If it feels a little light, you can go with doubles. There we go. Good controlled movements. Try to feel it kind of in between the shoulder blades and then on the backs of the shoulders, the rear delts. You know, trying to burn out a little bit or pre exhaust, I should say. Not burn out, pre exhaust. First. <clears throat> There we go. One more. We're going in to Rose's left side. Vans, if you want to be seated, you can. If not, 
we're going to do is bend to under the right foot. Dumbbells in advance. Right foot is forward. Right hand braces the back. Rolling with the left. The palm faces the body here. We're just kind of pulling to whatever is natural to us. There we go. Friends, if you wanted to be seated, right here, wrap it around. Make sure to fully wrap your bands around the foot here, and then just roll it one side, choke up on the bands as needed. There you go. So the reason we wrap the bands is so if our foot kind of comes up, the bands won't slide. They're not coming off my foot here. There you go. One more. Switching sides, rows right side. I'm going to do my seated again. I like a seated rows with band. I feel like I can use a lot, a lot more resistance here. <clears throat> If you're using dumbbells, you can also kind of push your elbow on the knee. So then you don't wear your tricep out. So I feel like as you're kind of sitting there, start to feel in your tricep, you're like, oh. There we go. Push your back out. Yeah, and then you kind of come all the way down, kind of right to yeah. the ground. Come on. Don't forget to breathe. Keep that back straight. Let's go. Come on, one more. Ah, there we go. Woo, 30 second break. We're going in to sumo squats. Get some water if you need it. So we're going to get our feet out nice and wide here. Dumbbells, you can just hold them out in front of you. Bands right here. I like to kind of point my toes out a little bit. Hold the bands right here, and we're just dropping straight down. Trying to sink down as far as we can. Here we go, drop it down, up and up. Down, up and up. There we go. Good controlled movements here. Don't forget to breathe. Weight in the heels, chest out, head up. Halfway. There we go. Keep pushing. One more. There we go. We're going into reverse lunges, left side. So our left leg is going to be forward, right leg drops back. We're taking a big step back here and kind of shifting our way back and then driving forwards again on these. Right leg forward. Left leg forward, right leg drops back. So here and then come up. Right here. There we go. Go with the doubles, huh? Watch your fuckers, you have that base beam right there. Oh, yeah. So as we come back, we're kind of shifting our weight back. Right here, coming up. We're not trying to stay forwards like that. 
you coming down. Hold on. Let's go. Come on. There we go. Switching sides. Perfect timing just to drop it, huh? Yeah. <laughs> it really was. So, right side, right leg is forward, left leg comes back. We'll just start down here. Okay. Were you about to get up? No, I was moving. Oh. Away from the mat. <sighs> There we go. Come on. Feeling the burn. Here we go. We'll forget to breathe every rep. Inhale down, exhale up. There we go. 30 seconds. We're going into flies. Dumbbells, <clears throat> you're going to be on your back, <clears throat> slightly in the elbows, kind of like we're doing chest openers, bringing our knees together. Bands, we're going to do a step on the band with our back foot, step away from it nice and far. We're going to kind of arch the back right here. So we get a nice line of movement here. Here we go, coming up and down. Here we go. If it starts to get too tough, what you can do is kind of bring your hands in, press up, flies down, press up. Flies down. Oh. There we go. Oh. Oh. Come on, ten seconds. Here we go. Push ups or chest press. Dumbbells are going to be on the ground right there. Same setup with chest press, just pushing. Bands. Get some heavier bands going on here. Wrap around the back. And then we're just going to press out. I'll demonstrate and then I'm going to switch to push ups. So right here, pressing out, bring the hands together. Just like that. You can do push ups, do push ups. Let me do some tough push ups today. Yeah, just do chest press. <laughs> right there. Woo. The fly is kind of pre exhausting the chest here. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh. Don't forget to breathe. If it gets a little too tough, you need a break, you can always drop down on the knees or just drop down on the chest. Give it like a two, three count, press back up, and then repeat as needed. Here we go. We got lying tricep extensions for dumbbells or bands. We can do Lion tricep push ups. I'm gonna put my bands down and then lay on them. Our hands kind of go over the top with them. So thumbs are pointed down towards us right here, pressing up. Dumbbells, that, as you bring them down, they're coming over the top of your head. 
You should choke up on your bands as needed. Oh yeah. Oh. 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 Come on. Oh. 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 Come on. Squeeze. Let's go. Here we go. 30 second break. We got shrugs coming up. So this set, with these three exercises, I believe we're going to be back, legs, chest. So bands get our feet out nice and wide, dumbbells not have your feet out. Nice and wide, we're going to bring the shoulders up, come back down, keep the head high. Come on, come up, squeeze, back time. You want to get a little hold up here? You can do that. If yours, if the weight you're using or resistance you're using feels a little bit light, you can always opt for more of the shrug with the high pull where you kick the elbows back and hands stay close to the body like that. It's a great one, but it's a little too light. I can't even do this, that one this way. <laughs> <laughs> that means you picked a good weight. Yeah, that's hard. Come on. <laughs> we go, we got already else. Bands go on your feet. About 10, 12 inches apart. Yourself somewhere around there. Hinging at the hips, sinking the butt back. We go dropping down and up. Down. There we go. Every time I come down, I'll kind of adjust my weight till I find the right resistance. Keep choking up on the bands. Go. Oh, yeah. Feel it stretch out. Come up. As far down as you can get without bending the back. Here we go. Woo. Uh, we have pike push ups, decline for dumbbells, decline chest press, or incline chest press for the bands. <clears throat> I'm going to do incline chest press for the demonstration, and then I will switch to pike push ups. Dumbbells, you can get those hips up in there, that glute bridge. Here we go. Come on, make sure that you're bringing the bands kind of to the top of your head. This would be like a normal chest press. Incline is here. There you go. Pike push ups. Pike push ups. I like to get my hands a little bit wider. Oh. 
Uh oh. We got bicep curls coming up. Looks gonna break right here. These push ups are fun. Triceps are on fire. <clears throat> the focus there. So, palms out. Right here. Curling up. There we go, coming up. And out. <laughs> There we go. Good controlled movement. <sighs> Starts to get too heavy. You can always alternate left and right. seconds. I'm kidding about the volume. Let's go. Keep pushing. <clears throat> Arms are pumped. Well, we're going to try some extension bands. Just drop a single handle on the ground dumbbells. You can use one or two dumbbells. So step on it, step through, thumb goes through the handle, up and over, other thumb through the handle. There we go, coming up. Oh, it tries. Mm -hmm. Nice and tired now, huh? Yep. <laughs> there we go. Come up, squeeze, back down. If you need to take a little quick break, that's fine. Drop it down, give it five seconds max. Get back into it. These are tough sets. Come on. Let's go. Push it. I do believe this is our last tricep exercise. So that's good news. 10 seconds. Oh. 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 Alternating close curls. Trying to pick a little bit heavier weight here. Ooh, I gotta shake that one out. Man. So I'm just gonna step a little wider on my bands to make them tougher. One arm at a time here. Coming across the body. Oh yeah. Let me that the water. Make it a little tougher. <laughs> That's it. Come on. Push it out. Come on. 20 seconds. Let's go. Squeeze. Squeeze. We got to do one more. 30 seconds. Shoulder press. Ooh. I got the sweat coming down now. Not even hot here. So for bands, I'm gonna drop down to my knee here. Put the bands through my legs. Knee goes on the bands. Shoulders or palms out away from us. Pressing up, coming down. Up, coming down. I like to have the bands on the inside of my arms instead of outside like this because on the outside they rub my arm real bad on the inside they kind of just clear the inside of the arm oh. Oh. 
good controlled movements here. Oh. Oh. Come on. Alternate. Push it out. Oh, come on. <laughs> that last little bit, every rep. Oh, come on. Oh, there we go. Spider Man crunches. Oh, I'm about to alert the uh, shoulders and triceps even more here. We're going to get in that plank position. <clears throat> Bring same side, knee to elbow. Here we go. So same side, knee to elbow here. If this is too tough, you can always drop down to the knees right here and do the same thing. Or you can hold the plank and just hold it right there. And even you can kind of hold plank for like 10 seconds or five seconds like that and then try to get a rep or two. <laughs> this was the uh, low-key second shoulder exercise. Come on. Oh, my shoulder's on fire. There we go. Oh, that was my shoulder break right there. <clears throat> oh, my shoulder's on fire too. Ten seconds. We can go to ten seconds. Oh. There we go. We got good mornings right here. You pick like a medium to light weight here. Want to kind of test it out. Make sure you don't injure your lower back. Going too heavy. We'll slide bend in the knees. We're bending at the lower back. And here it's kind of set up like RDLs, except we are bending at that lower back. So start with a light weight and then if it's too easy, move up. Just like Jim did. Yeah. There we go. Let's get one more. Oh, here we go. We're going in hip flexor stretch. Left side. We're going to the cool down here. Right leg is going to be out. Left knee down. Tighten that left glute up. And you're going to sink the hips forward. Here we go. Don't forget to breathe. Feeling it stretch out. Make sure that your upper body is nice and straight. We want to be leaned like this. That reduces the stretch. So nice and tall. Squeeze the glute. Sink forward. Switching sides. Again, squeeze that right glute and then push into it. There we go. It's a good workout today. Yeah, it was. My triceps. And shoulders. Oh, they were burning. Might be a little sore tomorrow. <laughs> no, we'll see. I'm gonna see how or see how this goes with my uh, hamstring stretch. Left side, so we're standing up here. Left leg forward, right knee's back, or right leg is back, slide bend in the knee, and then hinging at the hips. 
doing a stretch out back here. We're uh, going to see how this affects my chest workout with the barbell in a little bit. <laughs> it's going to be interesting. You don't want to stretch out back here. Switching sides, hamstring stretch right side. We're gonna have a slight bend, bend in that left knee. Don't forget to breathe. Here we go. Drop it down to the ground. Pure form and stretch. Left side. So right leg out, left leg crosses over. I'm gonna pull that left leg towards us. Spoiler like ring stones are crazy. Like you can hear it. Not used to it. No. Arizona, Florida is definitely a little bit of change in moisture content. No rain. <laughs> For forgetting what rain is to only knowing rain every day. I'm from Florida originally, so I'm used to it. But it was nice in Arizona not having the rain, sunshine all the time. Pure form of stretch right side. Here we go, quad stretch, left side, if you need to use an ottoman, a bench, a chair, a couch, whatever it might be, that's totally fine. Let's see if I can wrap this thing. Oh, better watch out for the cramps from overextending here. There we go. Now that we're halfway through the stretch, I'm in it. <laughs> Should drink plenty of water. Try to stay nice and tall, not leaning forwards. <laughs> Cross stretch right side. After this, we're finished. There we go. Fine. Oh, let me turn a little bit. Pull. Oh. Pull that heel, feeling a stretch out in the quad right here. There we go. We're done. Woo, good workout. Good job. Oh, that was a nice one. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, you know the drill. Be sure to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel. We'll see you on the next one. See you guys. Okay.